the World Chess Championship match, Grandmaster Ding Liren, the World Champion against the rising star Gukesh D, game number two. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel! The World Chess Championship 2024 is heating up and today we are diving into game number two between the world champion Grandmaster Ding Li Ren and the incredible Grandmaster Gukesh D from India. Before we begin, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more exclusive coverage, analysis and updates through the championship. Want to support the channel and get some awesome perks? Join Nitsan's team right here on YouTube. Membership give you access to custom emojis, loyalty badges and much more. The link is below and don't miss out the Outpost Chess website, the ultimate platform to play online tournaments, find affordable coaches and even compete for real money. Registration is completely free, so what are you waiting for? The link is in the description. So let's start with the game. Ding Liren with white pieces against Gukesh with the black pieces. So e4, e5, knight f3, knight c6. Of course, the bishop c4 move, the Italian opening. Bishop c5 and here d3. As you already know, c3 is the main line. Uh, but nowadays d3 is very common by the best players in the world. Knight f6 of course, black and also white as you can see just develop um, their pieces. So knight c3 and this is very ugly move. Sorry to say it but it's, it's you know like just play c3, play castle but knight c3 is, is so you know like so drawish equal move I don't know but okay this is how they are playing a6 very uh, strong move probably I think after d6 maybe some knight a4 move uh, just to take the uh, two bishops for for white for example bishop b4 check just c3 bishop a5 and b4 and this should be very nice uh, for white knight x b6 or maybe I don't know maybe h3 and the next move will be knight x b6 so two bishops uh, for white and it's it's really good advantage um, so a6 is very um, you know interesting move just to avoid from knight f4 because now bishop a7 will be played uh, and black is totally fine. So a4 was played d6 and I will just castle h6 just avoiding bishop g5 uh, bishop g5 because this is a little bit annoying uh, this queen with knight a5 just some pinning move so h6 uh, just a prophylactic move bishop e3 and as you can see Ding Liren is playing very fast with only two minutes waste until now. Bishop e6, wow, very, very joyish, very equalizing move. Just uh, once all the pieces disappeared, right, in the game number two in the World Chess Championship match. And now a5, very, very, um, you know, unusual move, I can say. For example, when I saw this game, I thought like maybe bishop takes e6, and after f takes, I thought bishop takes c5. With D takes, and now as you can see, you have like two double pawns, but overall should be very strong uh, for for black because there is like this very good square uh, for the knight, and these pawns on the center are doing great job. So a5, uh, and this is, was like probably the you know the novelty by Grandmaster Dingley Ren, and now just Bishop takes c4, D takes, and now just castling. And that's it. It seems like nothing to be afraid with the black pieces. And bishop takes c5 was played, d takes and b3. Ding Ren is continuing to play very fast, but Gukesh is not afraid from anything. Just queen takes d1, rook takes d1, uh, rook d8, rook dc1, I don't know, knight e4, very strong move. Uh, of course, knight e1 was played, but after knight takes e5, just rook f8. And after f4, just knight takes e4, knight takes e4, and f6, uh, I thought, but also knight e2, yeah, knight e2. After king f1, just knight takes f4, and one of these knights will be fall, uh, and black is totally fine here. So after knight e1, just rook d6, king f1, g6, rook d1, rook f d8. You know, until now it seems like everyone can play like this, right? Uh, it's not something very, very difficult for both sides. So f3, king g7, king f2. Uh, some you know improving moves overall but knight e2 knight c6 and then 
just going for uh, the three time repetition you know very droish game uh, by uh, both of them after winning game with the black pieces grandmaster dingley ryan said to himself you know what let's do a quick draw let's have some power for the next game for you know the rest of the match so droish uh, in the first in the second of course um game of this match the world championship match uh, between these two just amazing amazing players so ladies and gentlemen uh, there you have it game number two of the world chess championship 2024 what do you think about this game it's really interesting to see uh, in the comments below are you surprised by the outcome let me know your thoughts uh, and that's it you know if you enjoyed this video don't forget to smash 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 that like button and subscribe and of course hit the notification bell uh, just never miss a moment of thrilling championship and remember join Nitsan's team to get exclusive perks, uh, perks and support the channel um, and that's it thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video right here where we bring chess to life see you soon bye bye